Hey guys, uh, welcome to your career and money reading for Libra. This is going to be for your November 2023. You'd apply this to uh, your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. We are going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in your career and your finances. And then we'll take a look and see what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. Uh, keep in mind that these are general messages. Take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, you may take a look at your other placements. Keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective Libra people, not tapping into one specific person person's energies in particular if you're looking for a reading that's tailored specifically to your unique situations and your energies i suggest you to uh book a personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell so that you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when i go live also if you guys are interested in following me on tiktok and also on instagram the links for those are in the description box below i do also post readings on there too Libra. Tell me about Libra when it comes to their career and finances. What's going on with Libra when it comes to their career and finances for November 2023? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs for Libra. For Libra. Tell me about Libra here. Libra. Okay, Libra. Okay, the Magician, Gemini, Virgo, and the Justice card. There you are right here. Okay. You know, I feel like you guys are manifesting balance right now. Yeah, you guys are manifesting balance. Now, if you guys work in the justice system right now, you guys are definitely, like, you know, covering your bases, investigating, gathering all your resources and your information just to, like, maybe prove something here. Okay. Um, perhaps, you know, if there is some sort of HR uh, situation that's going on here, perhaps you're gathering all your receipts to prove that, you know, something transpired here, something happened here, okay? I don't know why. I feel like it could be like an HR situation here, okay? Um, I'm getting that, yeah, it could be some sort of like law situation here. Like I said, if you guys are lawyers, you guys are gathering all your information at this time here. I do feel like some of you guys might work in the justice system here, Okay. Uh, maybe a big decision is being made here regarding a case that you're on. But I also feel like it's also an HR situation here too because there's some sort of an investigation that's going on here. Okay, the Eight of Swords here and the Ten of Pentacles. Okay. I mean, it could be a, situ a situation that, you know, you were injured at work and you're getting paid out because maybe you, someone here, you know, took legal, legal action towards their employer or something like that. Okay, with the Eight of Wands here and the Ace of Wands. Wow. You are about to get paid out really, really, really well. And I feel like you're going to use this money here to start your own business. Okay? Yeah. I don't know. I, I'm getting a feeling that some of you guys could be starting a clothing line or something like that. But yeah, I I, I heard $80,000. I don't know. Um, You know, it could be any amount, but that's what I heard. I mean, um, yeah, keep in mind that these are general messages. But whatever this is, you guys are getting paid out really, really well to start your own business. Uh, uh, thing here. Tell me about the magician. Tell me about the magician. Why is the magician here? Okay, we have the star card, Aquarius energy. Tell me about the justice card here. Tell me uh, and the beyond. Okay, so this is um, this is gonna give you a sense of healing. This is gonna give you a sense of optimism about the future here. So there is some sort of decision that's being made here. Okay, and like I said, I feel like the justice system could be involved here. Uh, 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 you know, um, and like I said, this could also be an HR situation here. So just apply this to your own unique situation. We have the Eight of Swords here and the Three of Pentacles. We have the Ten of Pentacles here. And then, wow, um, this decision that's about to be made is going to be, it's going to make you extremely happy. Like I said, I feel like it's really going to fulfill your dreams or, or that it's going to um, kind of like, it'll give you the ability to pursue your dreams or something like that okay if you guys are looking to start a business or that you, if you guys always wanted to start a business here okay so the three of pentacles here and the nine of cups we have the eight of wands and the page of swords Libra, aquarius gemini and the ace of wands here and temperance make sure you take your time make sure you be patient about it but you know i do feel like uh you know whatever you're about to start here it's gonna go really 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 well because i feel like your guides and your angels and your ancestors are definitely supporting you on this new venture here okay so, but there will whatever decisions being made here, there will be some sort of healing here because I feel like there was some sort of like 
yeah, there was some definitely some sort of injury here. Something happened. Yeah, something happened where I feel like the legal matters or, or the, the legal system, the justice system got involved here uh, regarding a work situation. Tell me about... Um, Tell me about uh, Libra. What else does Libra need to know? I also get another thing where I feel like, you know, if you guys are contracted workers, for some reason, they are with, they're, they're holding your pay. They haven't paid you. Yeah, that's another thing here. So let's see. What else do we have here for Libra? What else does Libra need to know? Look out for work on. So this is, um, this is the, uh, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag here. This, uh, Three of Swords. Oh, there was definitely some sort of injury here too. Yeah, I'm getting multiple storylines for like, you know, I feel like it might help like a couple of people here. Uh, you know, sometimes when I do these general readings, you know, there are a couple of storylines that come up because I try to help as many people as possible, you know. Uh, keep in mind, these are not personal readings, uh, uh, you guys. It's almost like, you know, reading your horoscope every single day, you know. And it just can't resonate every single time. We have the Seven of Pentacles, Four of Swords. I mean, if it does re resonate, I mean, that's really great. That's really awesome. Uh, so we have the Seven of Pentacles here and the Four of Swords, Okay. And then we have the Queen of Swords and the Wind. Yeah, I just feel like everything, you know, luck is really on your side uh, at this time here. You know, I feel like there will be recovery. There will be healing here. You will overcome this, okay? Um, you know, I feel like there is definitely a bit of assist here, which is a, a good thing because like, whoever you're working with here, when it comes to this, they're definitely looking out for you and they're definitely uh, looking out for your best interest here, okay? Tell me about the Wheel of Fortune. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? We have the strength card, Leo energy. Yeah, I do feel like someone's health is improving. I, I really do feel like there was some sort of something physical that happened here where someone here got injured. Okay. And uh, maybe you guys do like a bit of a manual labor work here. I mean, if you were in an office job, maybe there was like a slippery area and someone here slipped and hit their head. Uh, but whatever this is, I do feel like someone here is about to get paid out. You know, I feel like it's almost like an energy like this money that you're receiving here. You're kind of like set for life in a way. But yeah. I mean, $88,000 is a lot of money to get paid out at one time, you know? But I mean, it could be more, it could be less, depending on your situation here. If this is even your situation. We have the Two of Cups here and the Five of Wands. Seems like this was a lar large, long, arduous fight here. Or a battle. But it's definitely coming to a close here. Yeah, there's definitely some tensions here. Yeah, there's like a bit of like um, <sighs> awkwardness and, you know, some sort of discomfort here. You know, I almost get the sense that your work situation was trying to bribe you out of this. Yeah, but I feel like you took matters into your own hands here. You know, I do feel like through this um, situation, I do feel like you've changed a lot. And I feel like, you know moving forward, there's going to be infinite possibilities for you, infinite growth, you know, when it comes to your finances, when it comes to uh, your career here, okay? So it seems like, you know, a horrible thing is leading to a good situation here in a way. So um, Libra, I hope that this was helpful. I hope that this resonated. If it did, leave a comment down in the comment section below. Like this video, share this video, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I will speak to you guys in the next one. Thanks, guys. Bye.